What if I told you that the very nature of reality isn't as solid as it seems? Welcome to the perplexing world of quantum physics, a realm that challenges our fundamental understanding of reality and matter. In this universe, the ordinary rules of physics are tossed aside, replaced by theories that seem more at home in a science fiction novel than a textbook. Take the concept of superposition, for instance. This principle suggests that particles can exist in multiple states at the same time. Imagine a coin that simultaneously heads and tails until someone looks at it. That's the essence of superposition. It's not that the coin is one or the other, but rather it's both at once until observed. But don't be fooled into thinking this is just a quirky trait of the subatomic world. This quantum oddity influences everything around us, from the light we see to the technology we use. The implications are far-reaching, touching every facet of our existence. This quantum uncertainty prompts a profound question. Is there more to reality than meets the eye? Now imagine ancient scriptures discussing concepts that resonate with modern quantum theories. Enter the Vedas, the ancient Indian texts that delve deep into metaphysical concepts. These texts, written thousands of years ago, propose a view of the universe that might seem eerily familiar to the modern quantum physicist. The Vedas depict the universe as a play of vibrations and consciousness, a dance of energy and matter, if you will. They suggest that all we perceive is a manifestation of a primal vibration, the sound Om, which resonates with the quantum idea that all matter is simply energy in different states of vibration. Furthermore, they propose that our consciousness is intrinsically linked with the universe, echoing the quantum entanglement theory where particles remain connected irrespective of distance. Intriguingly, the Vedas also hint at the possibility of multiple realities and dimensions, a concept that quantum physics is still grappling to comprehend. Could these ancient texts be speaking a language that only now science begins to understand? Let's dive deeper into how both these worlds converge in their understanding of reality. Quantum physics introduces a fascinating concept known as the observer effect. This principle suggests that the mere act of observing can influence the observed. Reality, in a way, becomes a subjective experience shaped by the observer's interaction with it. Now let's turn to the Vedas. A similar idea echoes through these ancient texts. The Vedas propose that reality is not a passive construct, but is actively influenced by consciousness. The observer with their conscious mind plays a significant part in molding the fabric of reality. What's striking here is the parallel. Both quantum physics and the Vedas, though separated by centuries and cultures, arrive at a similar conclusion. The observer is not merely a passive spectator, but a key player in the unfolding drama of existence. The line between the observer and the observed blurs both in cutting-edge physics and ancient spiritual texts. But why does this matter in our daily lives, you may ask? Well, the quantum enigma and the wisdom of the Vedas, they're not just abstract concepts. They're tools that can help us navigate the complexities of existence. For instance, quantum physics, with its peculiarities, challenges our conventional understanding of reality. It urges us to question, to dig deeper, to never take things at face value. On the other hand, the Vedas provide a spiritual compass, guiding us towards inner peace and personal growth. They teach us about Dharma, the moral law combined with spiritual discipline that guides one's life. The essence of Dharma is to think beyond oneself, to realize the interconnectedness of all beings. So, you see, these two seemingly disparate fields, one rooted in science, the other in spirituality, both converge on the same point, enhancing our understanding of life. They encourage us to be more mindful, more aware and more compassionate. Perhaps understanding these concepts can lead us to a more conscious way of living. Is it possible that science and spirituality are converging on the same truth? Let's explore this thought. Quantum physics, with its probabilistic nature and wave-particle duality, presents a reality that is fluid, interconnected and full of possibilities. On the other hand, the Vedas, ancient scriptures from India, depict a universe that is a complex web of relationships, where everything is connected to everything else. Curiously, these two distinct fields of study seem to echo each other. They suggest that our reality is not simply a mechanical system of separate entities, but an integrated whole, where every part affects the whole and vice versa. This is beautifully illustrated in the Bhagavad Gita, a portion of the Vedas, where Arjuna and Krishna engage in a dialogue. 
This dialogue can be viewed as a metaphor for the internal and external battles we face when trying to understand reality. Arjuna represents our scientific curiosity, questioning and seeking answers. Krishna, embodying spiritual wisdom, responds with insights that transcend the physical world, hinting at a deeper, mystical reality. The dialogue between these two realms might just be the key to unlocking the mysteries of the universe. Imagine the possibilities if we integrate these insights into our worldview. Have you ever thought about how this blend of quantum physics and Vedic wisdom could revolutionize how we perceive science, spirituality and their intricate dance? This isn't just about abstract philosophy, it's about the practical applications that could spring from such a synthesis. Think about the potential advancements in technology driven by a more holistic understanding of the universe's fabric. Envision the progress in mental health as we begin to appreciate the profound interconnections between our minds, our bodies, and the cosmos. And then there's the philosophical implications. This fusion could reshape our fundamental beliefs about existence, pushing us to question, to explore, and to grow. It could help us bridge the gap between the tangible and the intangible, the seen and the unseen, the known and the unknown. By bridging the ancient and the modern, we pave the way for a deeper understanding of our place in the cosmos. Today, we've journeyed through a fascinating overlap of ideas that span millennia. We've delved into the enigma of quantum physics, a realm where particles can be in two places at once and where observation shapes reality. We've also ventured into the ancient wisdom of the Vedas, which offer profound metaphysical insights about the nature of existence and the interconnectedness of all things. We've discovered surprising parallels in these seemingly disparate fields. Both quantum physics and the Vedas challenge our everyday perceptions of reality. They invite us to look beyond the apparent and explore the underlying unity of the universe. This interdisciplinary approach holds immense potential. It can enrich our understanding of the universe, bridging the gap between science and spirituality, and offering a more holistic view of reality. As we continue to explore, remember that both science and spirituality offer us profound insights into the tapestry of reality. Perhaps in their convergence, we find the true nature of existence.